previously. Good lord, there's so many of you, and that has got to be the end. There we go, quit. So let's do quit here. And we didn't kill Vampire Prime, you know, we did 17.4 million points worth of damage using the rune trade so look at that stat on the screen there but we 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 we, we did do it you know it's uh Well, it turns out we did kill Reaper Prime. Let me share a little bit how I found this out. I woke up this morning and I was very disappointed in my Vampire Survivors gameplay. So I went and had a look online and I read a bit of text that said that the Reaper does not appear effectively as an unlock when you complete the game. And it's like, what? No. Well, we know it wasn't there um, on the final session that we had right at the beginning. I know it wasn't there for a fact. So I went in this morning and by the beard of God, it was there so we had unlocked it you just don't get a little pop-up saying you've unlocked it so there you go a little note for you great people when you do millions and millions of points worth of damage the chances are it is actually going to be there but i wanted him for one reason because i wanted him to help us get boned in, in vampire survivors so let's go and see what i'm talking about right now so here we are vampire survivors and yes if you haven't subscribed please continue uh, so if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. But if you have subscribed, please continue to check that your subscription is still active because once in a while it drops off. Anyway, let's have a quick look to see what we've got. If we go to start here, we've got Red Death. Look, there he is. He is absolutely there. So that is a good place to be. Now, we want to basically win the game. We really, really want to be able to win the game. And there's a character that I've never been able to beat, and it's a special boss character, and it's actually in the Bone Zone. So we're going to go on a journey to try and beat a character in the Bone Zone. But what we're going to do is select Red Death, and we do Start. And we are going to, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? We're going to do the Bone Zone here, do Start again. We will pick this one here that we like, which is Awake, and we do Get. Now, because I've played this previously, you will see these funny little wing things on the left-hand side and the right-hand side of the screen. You know, those are items uh, when you complete the infinite corridor, you get special bonus items on the map. So we're going to be running towards them to try and get both of those. I want the red item and I want the left item. And then I'm going to work very quickly at evolving those items to basically try and get, get them as high leveled as I possibly can. Nothing else matters this vampire runs so fast you know his movement speed is absolutely phenomenal so it won't take us long to get to these in fact we might get to one just now i'm looking at the one on the left hand side and as the arrow moves up a little bit that always tells you that yeah you'll get in there um here we are here we are grab it all right so we got that and we need to evolve that to its maximum level um to give us i believe some kind of super bonus that we have i've never evolved it to its maximum level but we need to evolve the one on the right as well so it's just going to be run 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 all the way till we can get there i'm trying to avoid enemies as much as possible in one minute we have got uh, the left hand side of whatever the hell that is called and we're now heading towards the right hand side so a little busy busy we will fight things we will look at leveling up um but yeah this is the first goal to get both of these you know i'm assuming that we will get it on the three minute mark considering it took us you know, about a minute or so to get it the first time then you've got to run back to where you were then effectively keep running across because we started off in the center of it all so it shouldn't take too long and if we can stay at level one you know for a little while that will be quite good as well you know I, I want to be I want to be level one when I get that so I'm avoiding, I'm avoiding the, the little gems and everything. Come on, near, near, near. When that, when that yellow box starts moving um, around a little bit, you know, it shows you're getting closer when it goes up or down, depending on the exact position of it. There we go. We're quite near now. We are quite near now. There we go. We got it. We have got it. All right, good. Alright, so now we're going to try and level up things, but you know what? We will take 
the pentagram because that will be useful later. So I'm making my own rules up on this one on how I think I can kill the bone thing based on what I know about this game. Um, fingers crossed I'm not screwing it up. Alright, so nothing we want there. Oh, we should probably take the garlic. No, we'll, we'll do a rerun. We'll take the duplicator. There we go. We'll fire more things at once. So let's collect a few of these. Come on, come on. Alright, we were there. Okay, so we will we, we skip that one. That's probably a mistake to do that. But I'm trying to have less things on the screen to level up because we've got to level up those red things. So duplicator is now done. Pentagram is probably the only thing I think we now need to level up. We'll check on the next level up to see. Okay, our pentagram. Oh, we can do these now. All right, so it is giving us those options. Lovely. Come on, gems, come to me. Um, take a tome as well for weapon cooldown, so it shoots faster. In fact, it might be worth. Just working on the toes, come to think about it. Let's see what we get in here. We'll take that. Oh, if it had been a 5 1, that would have been excellent. Okay, we've got another tome. Good, good, good. Well, I, I want to look at the speed of our um, weapons that this red death flies out. But how long before the next one? Okay, yeah, that's reasonably quick. If we can really speed that up with a few more tones, all the better. Because we need this for the bone guy. All right, let's do a reroll. Uh, we'll, 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 we'll take that. take that you know what actually I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to play this level and try and fully maximize the red fins as well I might as well show you as much as possible so when you unlock, unlock the infinite coin with corridor every map will have those on as well as the gold and the silver coin that we don't care about for the time being Right, Red Death moves so fast, it's quite good, it really is. Alright, let's take another one. Yep, yeah, we'll take another one of those. This is a great character. I am so pleased I got this after all the recent stresses of trying to get him. I really, really am. And I didn't even know I had him. Alright, okay, yeah, another another one of you. Yes. Okay, we've got a chest. We got a chest. We missed a chest. There we go. We got a chest. Tome. Give me a tome. Oh, no. Never pentagram. Okay, that's alright. Well, that's fine.
those are coming out at a reasonable speed now. I'm quite happy about that. All right, so leveling up shouldn't be too challenging if we could just stay alive and not have to use any revives. All right, uh, yeah, we take that. We, we have to focus on those. The pentagram, the more you level it up, the um, eventually it stops doing damage to the crystals, which is great. Tone like that's maximized. Those red crystals are behaving a little bit differently to what you saw on the previous ones because they're just there on the screen and they do drop um, once in a while, but we're not in a position where we don't have any more room on the screen for gems because we're moving around and we're not in a static position. So that's why we see the odd one like that. Okay, uh, what are we going to have? We're going to have you. Yes, here we go. All right, our health is running a bit low here. Worry, worry, worry. So we're going to run away from all that craziness up there to hopefully get things a, a little bit better on the health. We've got revives, so we're kind of okay. Oh, and we're down, and we are down. All right, pick a revive. That's fine. That is fine. Increases cursed item, but increases my projectile speed, duration, and area by four. No, we take that pentagon there. Harder now. Ooh. All right. Okay. So we want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We need to do one, two, three, nine, ten. We need to do about ten, um, more, ten more levels, and then, and then we'll, we'll hopefully need a chest. But if this is a multi chest that gives us loads of stuff, that wasn't, you know, a chest will help. They will give us a lot of bits and pieces once in a while, but not this time. But the pentagram is now fully leveled up. All right, okay, that's fine. All right, okay, uh, Magneto left, yes, hello. This will hopefully be the perfect run where I kill the guy that I want to kill at the end. Oh, and we lost, we lost, we lost. Right, another Magneto there. Another Magneto there. All right. Okay, so effectively, six more levels is what's needed. Oh, look at this. Oh, we want a chest now. We, oh, I think we're there. Maybe it's one more that is needed. Yeah. Um, right, what are we going to do now? What are we going to do now? Let's take the max health. It's a chest that I need that is absolutely a chest that I need.
Okay, we got the hag. Oh, we got a hag up here there as well. So yeah, we're gonna increase our our health, our max health. Oh, we're gonna start banishing stuff, I think. Oh, ah, oh, Laurel. We need the Laurel. Oh, okay, that will evolve those things. I didn't realise I needed the level to evolve that um, last thing, bollocks. Alright, well that was lucky, that was lucky. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay, 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 right. More laurel. Okay, we need a few more of those. We just gotta survive. We have just gotta survive. Oh, and we got caught by that bollocks revive. I don't know how many revives we got left. Okay, lower all level five. All right, two more. Oh, do we take that? Yeah, we should probably take that. Yes, the last one. Alright, we need a chest now. And we need to hope, hope, hope that we can evolve the right thing. And by the right thing, I want to evolve those two red things together. Alright, uh, lightning ring evolve. Yeah, we might as well. Okay, lightning ring again. There's a lot of enemies appearing on the screen at once at the moment. That's fine. We've just got to keep moving. We've literally got to keep moving. Okay, okay, uh, lightning ring, we'll, we'll, we'll take another one of you, yes. And another lightning ring there. Alright, okay, good, good, good. Come on, just a chest, just one chest, please, just one chest. They will be appearing by a little uh, yellow arrow that we get, we will see when we've got a chest. Okay, we've got, ah, okay, so... We got uh, an arcane chest, all right. So, cooldown of weapons. Listed weapons generate explosions when they expire. Google of illusions. Uh, armor also affects. Da, da, da. All right. So, what have we got? We have got. One of those weapons that will create explosions. And we have got... It's 50-50. It's, it's, it's those two.
All right, now let, 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 let's let's do this to cool down. There we go. All right. Give me a bloody chest. We'll take that, that's going to give us more revives. That might be useful. Take that, another revive, yes! Chess. Come on, be the evolution, be the evolution. I think that's it. I think that is it. So, Evolve Royal caps incoming damage at 10. Uh, I think we're okay. So, we won't get hurt very much. Yeah, look at us, look at us go, look at us go. Bone Man, we're coming for you, we are coming for you. Alright, let's upgrade you. Magic Wand, uh... You know what, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll take you. Okay, and we'll take a, another magic wand. Oh, and we died, but we got some revives. All right, we're getting a bit cocky there. All right, let's take more hearts. All right, and now, now we're going to go down. Now we're going to go down. So, right, we basically got to go uh, to the bottom left. Start moving left a little bit more. Check the map. Yeah. All right. So he is running. So he is basically running uh, to the left. He's rolling to the left. He's very small to start off with, but he gets bigger and bigger, which is why. We have such great weapons at the moment. All right, what are we going to get now? Something else is going to evolve. I think, I think that's the duplicator. Oh, Fondaloop. Okay, lovely. We are four. We are the Thunder God. All right, and we're going to take... The claw glance it because that will freeze things in time. Oh, we've got ages to get this ball yet, by the way. We're okay with what we're doing here. Right. Let's fill up our. Let's fill up our hearts. Alright, clock glance it. So we've got to go up a little bit. We're heading towards the question mark. And there we are. We keep going this way. And we should see him shortly. And he's going to be a little ball. This can be a giant ball as well. There we go.
and we can really harass the hell out of this ball because it can only do 10 damage to us at a time. Um, we're protected a little bit, you know, we should be doing a lot of damage. So I'm going around it trying to kill anything that's around it getting in the way. Because you, everything that touches it, it grows to. Oh, I don't know what this is going to be. It'll probably be a lancet or a wand. getting bigger, it's getting bigger, which is a bit annoying. But it's certainly going to be hurting. Yeah, it's getting big now, look at the size of it. We might have left it too late. We might have left it too late. We're going to revive and we're going to run into it again. Let it roll into us. Maybe we just keep pushing it. Huh. Let's push it. So it's not really hurting us because of uh, the, 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 that, that evolved uh, cape thing that we've got, which is good. This might not have been the best tactic, you know, but I'm sure, having fun, I really, really am. It is so big. Have you ever seen a monster this big in Vampire Survivors? Will we even kill it? So I'm basically just pushing northwest against it. Oh, we're going to go west now. Oh, he's getting faster than me. Oh, I need to I need to get round in front of it. There you go. Alright, so let's do more ones. There you go. No, oh, that's gonna make much difference. And we're gone. We do a revive. Okay, we're gonna try and stay completely underneath the centre of it, purely so the things that we shoot up go up and hit it. I hope, I hope they do. Something's surely got to be hitting it. Or do we find what way it wants to roll? What way does it want to roll? There you go, look. right, so let's stay there. Alright, so it's completely on top of us. We're protected by... We can only take 10 points damage. I think it's got too much health. I think it's got way too much health.
try and get in front of it again. Look at the size of it. This is, oh, this is, this is really, really challenging. Oh no, it's going the wrong way. Maybe it can be beaten at this size, I just don't know. It seems too big to be beaten because, you know, all it's doing is gathering up skeletons all the time. Maybe, 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 if we get to the 30 minute mark and it's killed because we will only have, um, uh, Reapers at that point, or at least a Reaper, you know, maybe that counts as a kill. Alright, okay. And obviously, every enemy that it hits, it is just getting stronger and stronger. So I've got to be doing more damage per second, I believe, in terms of any enemies that are going to be there, then what it's, what it's learning and grabbing. Yeah, if this dies on the 30th minute, on the screen. Maybe that is classed as a death for it. Look at all those poor skeletons crumbled together. And you saw how small, it was such a small ball to start off with, wasn't he? And now he's as big as a planet. Okay, that red cape is what's keeping me alive. The red cape is what's keeping my character alive. Okay, lots of lightning is also helping, but that red cape um, is definitive in why we are where we are. Hollow Heart has probably helped by giving us a bit more life. Can I get in front of it? Oh my holy hell, look at how big it is now. was it game over we had to quit there well that didn't work out too well did it you know what let's try one more time we did well though we oh my god damage 48 million um from the pentagram that, that that's surprising but look at that the death spiral that didn't do too much damage at all all right so let's just go done start start pick you again and this time uh, what shall we take? What shall we take? So we look through here, seeing what will be worth taking. We'll take that. We'll, we'll do. We'll do the usual. And what we're going to do now is sod it. Straight down and attack. Yeah, he got a bit big last time, a bit too big for a heroic Reaper to handle. So a little test here for me for future. We're running straight down on 30 seconds, I'm going to see where we are on the map. Alright, so 31, 32, 33. Alright, so it's probably 32 we need, there we go. <laughs> and we died. We, that's because we ran into it. Yeah, 
King Bible will help us here as well when it kicks off. But the key for me is stopping this time round any skeletons touching it. Oh, and we died again, we died again, all right. It's going to be a lot harder than what I think it's going to be. Uh, let's take the cross. Aims at the nearest enemy. Alright, and we will take that. Oh, we're going again. We keep touching it. Crosses. All right. So what we do? We're shooting. We're shooting those things, and we then get in front of it and do a quick circle round to see whether we can take anything else out. More Bibles. That was a chest one, I knew that, because he was basically uh, had a different colour around the outside of him, so we had to go for him. Alright, and now back to the bone ball. Now back to the bone ball. Oh, we went... Oh, no, 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 no. Got to be careful, got to be careful. Let's take the rural to help protect us a little bit now. Alright, uh, we'll take Hollow Heart for the health. I'm just trying to stay alive here. I think I'm on my last revive. Oh, we changed direction. We changed direction, but I caught you doing it. Big, you are getting a bit big now. Alright, uh, more projectiles from Ace of the Sparrow for you. We 
Okay, there's just one there. All right, attract all, but help me level up a little bit more. I'm trying to kill that for another bonus. Just die! There we go. Oh, I was hoping for more. I was hoping for lots of power-ups there. Alright, done. Right, let's find our little friend. There you are. Alright, King Bible. More King Bibles for you. Reaper, come on. All right, okay, more King Bibles, come on. Uh, oh, we'll take the one on the other side as well. So there you go, more shooting at you, more shooting at you. Come on, I think we've got one more revive left. No, we haven't, no, we haven't. All right, we're gonna call it a day at that. I am fed up of vampire survivors. But we got the Reaper, which is what we wanted to do. We didn't quite get boned as we wanted to do. But you know what? I certainly had fun playing this. All of you stay safe. All of you take care. And I will see you in the next video. I promise, I absolutely promised you, is not a Vampire Survivors video. Goodbye. Please like, share, and please like, share, and subscribe to this channel.